a little bit of race info for the Total Sports Xterra um, Pizula, the Foo. That will take place on the 9th of July, start time 12.30. Guys, remember we have the light beforehand, so parking will be an issue by the time you rock up there. If you really need to park close, come early and come and support the light guys. The Foo will start off with a 30 kilometer run. Um, it's one kilometer flat. Um, position yourself, get to your position as quick as possible. You turn right in a quite a steep little single track climb. For another one kilometer, get to the first water point and on your way back, um, it's a steep downhill. Take care, we had some incidents in the past coming down the cement slopes, running back to transition. Off you go from transition on your 23k mountain bike loop. Your first three or four k's on a cement fairly flat within the Pazula private estate before you turn left and go down the only single track of the event is about two, three hundred meters. Um, after that, it's you do a, a, quite a fair amount of climbing on this event, although there's no major climb, but then there's no major flats either. So yeah, it's mostly up or down. The toughness of the event is basically how hard you want to race it. Your biggest problem might be if it's raining, it's a mud, it can be a bit slippery. Apart from that, it is an easy ride back to the, you know, down, downhill to the transition area. The grass is a bit slow. And then you do your second run, which is a seven kilometer run. Um, your seven kilometer run starts with quite a big climb. It will be your biggest climb on the run of the day. And then you go right closer to the sea through some canopy running in some awesome, you know, natural forest on the Brazula private estate. It's a really awesome run. Um, it's most probably the, the trademark of this event is the, the second run of the two. Um, you come down with a single track, straight back into the finish line after about seven kilometers. And yeah, that's, that's it done for the day. Um, basically on your run you'll have two water points, one after about two k's and one after about five k's. On your, that's only on the second run. Your first run of three kilometers will have one water point, roughly about two kilometers in. And your mountain bike of 23 kilometers will have one water point after about 11 kilometers. That's it.